<laughs> I stay in my lane. Yeah. In my lane. I can never change. I think I'm stuck in my ways. Woo. Look who I became. Look who I became. Shorty begging for me, yeah, she want my last name. What's the deal? I don't care about how you feel. I like money, dollar bills. I got extra time to kill. I be wildin' out for real. You ain't really in the field. Rex on Rex, I got a bill. Yeah, I'm buy my checks for real, nigga. Ayy, I ain't trippin' shoes lace. Questioning my loyalty, but you is two faced. Niggas. What is up, Boo Boo Gang? So today, we're gonna be writing to Bill Burr. How you know the N word is coming? Shout out to all the people worldwide. Worldwide. All the subscribers. Shout out to all of y'all. You know what I'm saying? We back in effect. Oh, man. Just chillin'. Sorry, I'm hype. Why? Because, I don't know. No reason. So, this is gonna be our second time reacting to Bill Burr. Alright? Y'all really, really, really enjoyed the last one, so we back at it again with another one. This is how you know the N word is coming. I don't see him say it. <laughs> ain't no problem. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna know what's coming. If they, they, they say it, then. Are you oh, ready? Yeah. Oh, listen, who? Am I what? Ready. Am I what? Ready. Nah, I don't know what that is. Oh my gosh. All right, let's go. down the south man i had a real weird experience last time i came down here i was in nashville right sort of an awkward social situation right i'm sitting at this bar there's this white dude sitting like two stools away i don't know him he doesn't know me and that terrell owen story was in like sports news so i try to make conversation i'm like man look at this guy this guy just signed a 40 million dollar contract he's already bitching man how much money do you need to make and the dude looks at me he's like you know what i say and then he looked over his shoulder, which I now know is the telltale sign that the N-word is coming. And it's coming hard. Oh yeah, it's not going to be pronounced with the A, it's going to be with the R. And he hit the R, he like stuck the landing. It was like a dismount, clan members high-fiving in the background, like pulling the wave. Just out of nowhere. So now, immediately, I'm looking over my shoulder like, what the hell are you doing? This hail of black fists to come raining down on top of me. I hate when people do stuff like that. That dude made me part of like a potential ass kicking that I had nothing to do with. You don't do shit like that. He just had that word hot potato just threw it in my lap. Trying to pass it down to the next white dude. Oh my God. I hate when people do that, man. You know, it's like, dude, fill me out first. Do you like to fish? Have you ever fucked your sister, right? What? I start rattling off answers, then you go old school. You give me a pamphlet, you tell me about your militia. Don't just dive into it. That dude was one of the angriest people I've ever met. I should have known that word was coming, because he was just watching Terrell, right? Anytime I would bring up, look at man, that guy's talking trash, he would just like flip out. He won't shut up! <laughs> Those people get like so mad they're not even looking at you. Their eyes are up. You just shut up! You're the point of the game! <laughs> you know what's funny? I don't even like Terrell, but now I love the guy. Because every time I see him talking trash, I know this idiot in Nashville is just losing his mind, like kicking over his kitchen TV. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> I am. I, not, not like when it happens to me or if I see it live. I like watching it on TV, you know? Watching people, you know, get attacked by animals. <laughs> Just get blasted in the face or something, you know? Oh my God. Like, I'm a huge sports fan. You know my favorite, like, moment of, like, the last year was in sports? That Detroit Piston, Indiana Pacer, bench clearing brawl. Wasn't that great? That was one of the greatest things I've ever seen. I was so confused when I watched ESPN that day. They were like, that was absolutely disgraceful. Basketball fans, they, they just must be a good. I'm sitting there looking like, I'm a basketball fan, I loved it. I thoroughly enjoyed watching out of shape civilians get the shit kicked out of them. <laughs> I'm a professional athlete. It was fascinating. And I think as sports fans, we kind of had it coming, right? 
Because how many times you gone to a game, right? You got a little too drunk, you started screaming at some dude on the field who could clearly kick the shit out of you, right? If you saw him in the parking lot, you'd be like, hey, can you sign my stamp collection? You're like, hey, you're awesome. You get in the game, you're all drunk, you're like, you suck, buddy! You're a piece of shit! And they're always calling him up, come on up here! No, come on up here! punched the wrong guy. Wasn't that great? No, he taught no, no, no. that dude a valuable no, no, no. lesson in life. When shit goes down, you don't just stand there like you're watching a movie like, Whoa! It's coming right at me! It must be in 3D or something! I was a 5 foot 6 inch, 110 pound white dude, had an angry 6 foot 10 inch black dude running right at him. That had to have been in his top 3 nightmares all time. <laughs> his dick cut off and being lit on fire. And he just stood there. He's like trying to explain himself. Well, I still have the liquid in my cup, so there's, there's no way I can... He's an idiot. Yo, he was beating up everybody. Oh my gosh, bro. I remember that joke. Like, no, like, you was a baby when that happened. Yeah, but I watched it, like, like now. Yeah. yeah. yeah that joke was crazy. Moment. Anybody remember that run on test? When he was on um, the Pacers and, and he fought the, the Pistons, oh man. That one was wildin'. Like, yo, like he was suspended for the rest of the year. You know what I mean, like, a couple of we got like 40 games, 30 games. I remember that joint. That joint was crazy. Mm -hmm. That's what happens, though. You know what I'm saying? The fans think that they entitled to just throw things at you, pour things on you. can't be doing that. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Like, people, people are human beings, man. <laughs> Fans be getting their feelings. Yeah, man. But well, shout out to that boy. Bill Burr. Bill Burr, whatever his name is. He funny. Yeah. Make sure y'all subscribe. Subscribe, man. Smash the like button. Subscribe. Peace out. Peace. <laughs>